I'm Maria Brown, welcome back. Well, everyone loves my guacamole and they're always asking me for my recipe. So today, I'm going to show you how to make it. Come on, let's go get started. I use two ripe avocado, one whole lime, one whole jalapeno pepper, one whole plum tomato, and I use about a quarter of a cup of onion. If you don't like onion, just leave it out. I use about a half a cup of cilantro. Now, go ahead and wash your lime first because you're going to use all the zest on the outside. So here, I've taken the zest off. I'm going to use that and then I'm going to cut this right in half and, and I'm going to squeeze all that juice right over the avocado. The Italian plum tomatoes are really the best for guacamole. They're exactly the right size that you need. When you cut this open, you wanna take all the seeds out. Then chop that up, just nice chunks. That one plum tomato is approximately a half a cup. If you like your guacamole really spicy, you can leave that rib and those seeds in. That's really where the majority of the heat comes from. But for me, I always take that out. So I'm going to just take a spoon. This is a grapefruit spoon. It's really good for digging out things like these seeds. So I'm just going to take these right out and get rid of those. Once I've taken the seeds out, I then cut it real thin slices. And then once it's all cut, put it all together like this. I'm gonna use the whole thing. And you chop it really finely. Keep your fingers bent when you're chopping. Hold the tip of your knife in the front and then just chop away. When you cut your avocado, lay it down. Just go all the way around in a circle and then give it a twist and that comes right off. To take the pit out, just use your knife and be careful of your hand. Just press down on that and give it a twist. Now let's get that little piece out of the way. Take your avocado half and now carefully, now you don't wanna go through this cause you don't wanna cut yourself. Carefully make a little grid. So just make these little lines going down one way and then go across the other way. And now we're gonna take any kind of spoon and we're going to just take this right out of here and drop it right into the bowl. See how it comes out in these nice chunks, already chunked up for you. Grab all that extra out of there. Don't leave any in there. Now that we've cut up the avocado, we're going to add the lime juice, give it a good squeeze. And if you need a little help, take a spoon and help you drag out some of that lime juice. Cover that one. Now we're gonna do the other half, squeeze that, and everything else just goes in. We're going to put in the cilantro and we're just going to mash it up. This is a pastry cutter. You could just use a fork and you wanna keep it chunky. If the avocado is ripe enough, you don't have to mash it very much. I'm going to give this a good mix now with a spoon. I'm going to put in a little kosher salt and some freshly grated pepper. Just give it a little taste to make sure you've got enough of the flavors that you like. And you just put it in a little container, serve it with your favorite chip, and you are ready to go. Give me a thumbs up if you got anything out of that video. Leave your questions and comments below and be sure to subscribe. Until next time, I'm Maria Brown. Thanks for watching.